Good morning, Indian Creek. At this time, please take a moment of silence to reflect on the anticipated activities of the day. Thank you so much. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Hey, once again, good morning, everybody. It is a terrific Thursday, January the 27th, 2022, and here are your announcements. All right, so first of all, first of all today is a B day. Okay, so you'll be attending your third, fifth, and seventh period classes for connections today. A reminder to everyone of the safety protocols that are currently in place. Masks are currently mandated and they should be worn over your nose and mouth just like that, making sure that you pinch that little metal piece on the top there. Uh, continue to keep your distance as much as possible, as far away as possible is important. And uh, wash or sanitize your hands as often as you can. Um, I want to reinforce and re-emphasize, uh, I've been receiving phone calls and emails and text messages in the middle of the night. Um, I want everybody to understand that the eighth grade is not in a lockdown situation. We are not in a lockdown situation. We we're just doing modified transition to minimize the number of students in the hallway. So uh, for everybody who's going home and telling their parents that uh, we're in the lockdown situation for the eighth grade. That is not an accurate statement. All we're doing is limiting the number of people in the hallway at any given time. All right, so the boys, woo, the boys basketball team last night advanced in the playoffs to the finals with a defeat of the Edwards Patriots, 49 to 47. Uh, the boys are going to play right here at the Creek tomorrow evening at seven o'clock. And I, we believe right now that they will be playing Davis for the New Rock Championship. So once again, Go Fan tickets will be posted for those games that are going to be held here tomorrow night, today sometime. So if you want to buy tickets for the game tomorrow night, go ahead and do so once the Go Fan link gets out there. But it appears that we will be playing Davis at 7 p.m. right here at the Creek tomorrow night for the championship. Now at 5.30, there's gonna be a girls game and that will have uh, the Edwards Patriots playing against the Liberty Knights in the girls final. Once again, that's at 5.30 tomorrow night. You have to buy tickets for one or the other or both games. Uh, it, tickets are $6 a piece. Uh, if you wanna to go to both games, it'll cost you 12. So uh, tickets for each game uh, will be on sale on GoFan. So go ahead and buy those tickets. Now, if you're coming for the boys game, uh, obviously, you won't be allowed to go into the girls game, um, but uh, we will house all ticket holders for the boys game in the cafeteria until we can get the gym cleared of the girls fans. Okay, so that's tomorrow night, 530 and 7. Teachers, we need to, uh, uh, we need volunteers to make sure that the event runs smooth tomorrow night. So please remember, each teacher is required to work two events each semester. And we need your support to come out uh, for supervision. We're going to have a lot of people here tomorrow night. Uh, I think we're the um, uh, the percentage is at at uh, fifty percent, so we'll be at three hundred people in the gym. So we'll need as much uh, assistance as we can possibly get. Remember, we still are um, adhering to the mask mandate uh, during events as well. The ICMS Art Club is going to meet today from four thirty to five thirty. Uh, if you are wanting to participate, uh, make sure that you stop by and see Miss Lean in the art room if you need more information. If you've already made that contact with her, uh, make sure that you have a ride here by 530 to pick you up. And um, yeah, so let's make sure that uh, you have all that information taken care of. Once again, that's 430 to 530 today. Soccer tryouts are going to be held next Monday and Tuesday. That's January 31st and February 1st from 4.30 to 6. Please remember that you must have a physical on file. And I believe that Coach Gourlay is actually collecting those physicals. So once again, 
If you are going to try out for soccer, we need to make sure that you have a physical on file before you hit the field on Monday or Tuesday, or Monday and Tuesday, preferably. All right, the yearbook order center is now open. Okay, so if you're wanting to order a yearbook, uh, you're going to want to go to yearbookordercenter.com. And uh, let me bring up that information for you so that you have the most current information available. Let me share that screen with you. We have uh, yearbook order. There we go. All right, yearbookordercenter.com. And you're going to enter the school code 15503, 15503. And that's going to get you to the Indian Creek order page. Remember, the yearbooks are $35 a piece. And if you want to have your name emblazoned on the front, then that's an extra five bucks. So it'd be $40 for your yearbook for today. Um, they, there is a great team of students and staff working on the yearbook to th this year. I think it's going to be an amazing document. So get yours before uh, the prices go up in May. I think it's May that they're going to go up. So um, with that, uh, I'd like for everybody now to join me in reciting the Panther promise so that we can be reminded of what it is to be part of Panther Nation. I will be respectful. I will be responsible and I'll be a positive role model. And with that, I want to thank everybody for your attention this morning. I look forward to seeing you right back here tomorrow morning on Creek TV. Have a great day, everyone.